is your home of the famous Nexus fried chicken. Yeah, I got that, so let's go try it. Right, so I'm in a hotel here in Las Vegas. Yay! And we're gonna try some Filipino food. Yeah, so I got this food from this place called Filipino. I mean, Max's restaurant here in Las Vegas. And um, they have a lot of locations nationwide. So do check out their website if you want to try their food. <laughs> the food looks so good. Okay, so um, let's start with this one. Yeah, so I got us their Max's uh, famous whole fried chicken. It looks really good. It's a small chicken. And it comes with a side of fries and some uh, sauces. And then for the sides, I got us the Lampiang Shanghai, which are egg rolls with uh, ground pork and vegetables, rolled in pastry wrapper and deep fried. And then I also got us some of their barbecue pork skewers. Uh, they say this is a must try, so I ordered it. And then I also got us their Pensit Canton noodles, uh, which is egg noodles sauteed with vegetable, pork, shrimp, and chicken. Right, so how is everybody doing? Good, I hope. Thank you so much for being here. I'm just having so much fun here in Las Vegas. Yeah, and I feel so much comfortable being here in the hotel room, you know, because the last few videos that were filmed outside, it was like really noisy and a lot of things going on. Yeah, so this is like a nice and quiet environment for filming. Yeah, but do you guys prefer me filming indoors or outside or both? Let me know down in the comments. <laughs> Right, I'm so hungry. Let's start with this one. The Lampiang Shanghai. Let's dip it in some um, sweet and sour sauce. Mm. So how are you doing? Some fries. Is it me or this chicken looks like Dobby? Like, can you see the face here? It's like Dobby, the house elf from Harry Potter. Like, this is the eyes and this is the nose, right? It looks like Dobby's face. Hmm. <laughs> Squeeze the lemon. Mm. Ah, so good. The noodles are a little um like a little bouncy. <laughs> I like it. Just switch places. Right, right. So it's been really fun here in Las Vegas. Um, it's not as hot right now, and um, the days can be a little hot, but it's not so hot like I'm um, doing the summer. And at night, it's pretty cooling, so it's a lot more relaxing. Compared to the last time when I was here in July, it was so hot. Oh my god. Like, it got up to like 100 degrees. Mmm. 
Man, those noodles are so good. Can't stop eating it. Hmm. Alright, let's eat Dobby. <laughs> Ooh, look at that. Mmm. Oh my god. You made it so soft. So good. Mm. Oh, this is really good fried chicken. The outside is really crispy and then inside the, the meat is super soft. It just falls right off the bone. Right, I don't have a knife so I'm just going to pick it up and bite it. Delicious. Right, so do you guys like to uh, gamble? Like blackjack or um, slot machines? Yeah, I'm not much of a gambler. But I did try to play uh, the slot machines downstairs in the lobby. Lost five bucks. <laughs> okay, let's try the barbecue pork skewer. Oh, oh, this is so good. Mm. Mm. Wow, this is so good. I like the little uh, burn bit. It's really nice. Mm.
Wow. Look, they have really good barbecue. Yeah, so do you guys like the gamble? Now there's a roller coaster here at the New York New York Hotel at the strip. Yeah, I really want to ride a roller coaster. But then it's twenty dollars for a ride. Oh my god. That's so expensive. Would you pay twenty dollars for a roller coaster ride? So you pay twenty dollars for like what a minute of fun? It's too much. If it's like ten dollars or like fifteen, you know, maybe, but twenty. This is super good. Which one? Hmm. Wow. I don't know what they did to it, but the taste is so good. It's like a little bit sweet. And then you got that barbecue char um, flavor in it. Oh. Yeah, so twenty dollars for a roller coaster ride, I'm not going for that. Yeah, I know it's expensive, but it's Vegas, you know, everything expensive here. <laughs> yeah, but not for me, knowing how cheap I am. Have you guys been to Las Vegas? I think the best time to visit would be like now around April because the hotel prices are like cheaper and the weather is kind of nice and maybe like November or December they have nice weather too 
I think the worst time to come to Las Vegas is in like July or August when it's like super hot. It's like a furnace. Well, but then maybe you like the heat. So tomorrow we'll be driving back to LA, which is like a uh, four hour drive. Okay, let's eat Dobby. Mmm. No. Oh. It's so soft. It just comes right out of the bone. So what shows are you guys watching? Ooh, have you guys seen the new uh, Batman yet? The Robert Pattinson Batman? I have not, but I'm going to watch it when we go back home. I heard it's really good. Oh yeah, and the thing about Las Vegas, a bottle of water, like if you buy it from a hotel lobby, it's five dollars. Five dollars for a bottle of water. Yeah, we brought our own water this time, but the last time we were here, my husband and I, we didn't know, right? So we went to the hotel lobby of uh, Paris, Paris Hotel here. Yeah, so we grabbed two bottles of water and a uh, can of um, soda. And then when we are at the counter paying for it, the person is like, $16. We were like, what? <laughs> two bottles of water and a soda, $16. We were shocked. <laughs> Because it's like five dollars each. Holy shit. So if you come to Vegas, you know, go to Target or Walgreens and get like um a 12 pack of bottle. Don't buy from um a hotel lobby. What a ripoff. <laughs> Alright, let's go for another one. Oh my god, this is so good. I don't think it's right to charge so much for water. <laughs> it should be free, right?
Hmm. Sorry, I was not eating my hair. <laughs> so good. Okay, so uh, this place, Max's Restaurant, I recommend it. Their food is really good. I really enjoyed um, their barbecue pork skewer. Yeah, I know it doesn't look like much, but it's so delicious. I don't know what they did to it, but the meat is just so nice. It's like there's, there's a little bit of sweetness to it, and then there's the barbecue char on it. Yeah, it's just super good. <laughs> really good. If, if you go to Max's Restaurant and you like barbecue, um, I would recommend that you try um, the barbecue pork skewers it's nice and then the pancit canton noodles that's good too um the noodles they have a bit of a bouncy texture to it so that's nice and then their um fried chicken <laughs> this one the one that looks like dobby's face right like this angle yeah, this is really good. It's very crispy on the outside and the meat inside is super soft. It, you know, it just falls right out of the bone. I'm gonna eat our skin later.
and let my husband have the rest. Yeah, so um, today's my last day here in Las Vegas. We'll be driving back home to LA before I will drive. Yeah, so I've been here for four days now. I've been eating nonstop for four days. Yeah, I think I must have gained like at least 10 pounds. I don't know. It's like uh, at the start of the trip, the first video, uh, the heart attack girl, I weighed 118 pounds. I think now I'll be like 128 pounds. I don't know. I'm not going to weigh myself. I'll get depressed if I see myself gaining too much weight. <laughs> so I try to avoid the scale as much as possible. Yeah, but I've been eating non-stop for four days. It's, it's, it's good though. All the food is really good. Yeah, so um, if I have not seen all my other uh, Vegas video, I'll put the links on top or playlist at the end of the video. Yeah, I did the heart attack grill for the third time and then I did uh, guys... Guy Fury, Guy Fury's uh, trash can nachos. That was disappointing. You know, I was hoping that nachos would stay in that position, that, that shape, but yeah. So I did the Guy Fury's trash can nacho. I did um, Buddy Velastro, you know, the cake boss. Yeah, I tried his uh, rainbow cake as well as his pizza. And then, and then I did this, you know, so uh, I'll put a playlist of my uh, Vegas food videos up somewhere oh yeah and also gordon ramsay's uh fish and chips that was super good like really good you know i i thought it would be like overrated you know but surprisingly it was really good if, if you come down to las vegas yeah you have to try gordon ramsay's fish and chips if, if you like fish that is i know some people don't like fish right yeah so if you come down to las vegas and you like fish and chips you have to try gordon ramsay's fish and chips it's not overrated. <laughs> it's very good. Like, really good. Is that uh, the Link? The Link Hotel? Yeah, and uh, it, before it even opens, there's like a long line outside of it. You know, so... But, but the line goes really fast. And then the fish is just incredibly good. It's like one of the best fish and chips I've ever had. It's super crunchy, and then the fish is like so soft. Oh my god. But the thing is, it's pretty expensive. <laughs> yeah. Well, you're in Vegas, and also it's Gordon Ramsay's place, so... Yeah, I, I got that, um... I got uh, fish and chips with three pieces of fish, and I also got the lobster with shrimp. Both of those together, I paid like 50 bucks for it. <laughs> expensive. Everything here in Vegas is expensive. In case you missed it earlier, I was talking about Vegas, about the water thing, you know, um... The last time we were here, my husband and I, we didn't know. So we went to uh, this Paris hotel. Yeah, at the lobby, they sell drinks, right? Water. My husband and I got two bottles of water and a soda. And the total comes up to $16. Yeah, because each bottle is 5 bucks. $5 for this. That's crazy. I still can't get over it. <laughs> it's so much. Yeah, so if you do come to Vegas, just bring your own water, like go to Target, get like a gallon or, you know, a 12 pack of bottle. Don't buy anything from the hotel lobby. It's a rip off. Yeah, so uh, this Vegas trip has been fun. Um, do let me know if you guys would like to see more uh, videos outside, like me filming at the restaurant outside. Yeah, I know some of you were saying that the music's too loud and, you know, you couldn't hear me talk and all that, but... uh. Some people like it though, so let, let me know if you want more outside videos or you prefer inside, quiet, you know, environment like that. Let me know down in the comments. And uh, since I'll be back in uh, Los Angeles, do let me know what you guys want me to eat there as well. Oh yeah, so big thank you to all my Patreon supporters. Thank you so much for your support. I appreciate you. Thank you so much for feeding me. <laughs> and thank you for watching my videos. I really appreciate you spending your time with me here. Yeah, so please give this video a thumbs up if you like it, so YouTube knows you like it, and don't forget to subscribe, don't mind my face, or give my page a like or follow so you see more of my videos. Yeah, so I'll see you on the next one. Click on here, 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 or here. See you in the next video.